Hello, I'm Jenny Gunning. I'm from Iron Bridge Fine Arts and Framing. Um, we're making a series of short movies to not only show you how to use the printing presses that we design and sell all over the world, but also how to make plates and print from them. Here is a short movie showing you how to print an intaglio plate. I'm printing from my newest Iron Bridge etching. The size is 20 by 30 inches. It has eight tones, two acrotints, as well as four different variations of line. Here you can see me mixing my ink. I use Intaglio Shop Mix Bone Black, mixed in with the pigments and different colours to get the colour that I like. I mix the ink with either copper plate oil or expensive mixing oil to get the viscosity to the correct consistency. I use mountboard corners cut with the edges sharp so that I can mix the ink well. You will want to take your time mixing the ink, making sure it's all pulled together and acting as one colour, especially if you're like me and you don't like to use ink directly from the pot. Also, if you're going to do a large print run, make sure that you're, you're mixing enough ink and you've got enough to use. Next is inking your plate up. Again, using your mount board corners with the sharp edges, pull your ink over the whole plate, leaving no area without ink. The mount board will push and pull the ink into the line and tone of the plate. Our printing presses will print the plate that you have made. It pulls the ink from the plate, leaving you with a lovely, honest print and a beautiful emboss. Inking in this way, using no scrim, will ink your plate up beautifully, making the inking process not only quick, but so enjoyable you will want to print whenever you have a spare second. The next stage once you have pulled the ink over the plate is to wipe the excess ink from the plate. I do this with newspaper torn up into manageable bits. Put the newspaper bit on the plate and in circular motions wipe. Do not crunch up the newspaper. Keep it as flat as you can and swap over the newspaper every, say, five seconds. This way you're removing only the excess ink and inking the plate up to print how you've made it. Don't forget to do your edges as there's nothing worse than printing your plate and finding the edges are messy. Next is printing your plate. You've already set the press to the correct pressure. If you need help with this, there is one of our short movies showing you how to do this with our presses. Put down a piece of paper to protect not your bed but your paper you're printing on. Then put your plate facing up then your paper that you have soaked in water for over 15 minutes and blotted or scraped to get rid of the excess water. Pull your blanket down on top of the pile and then pull your star wheel at a continuous pace until your bed goes all the way through and stops at the other end. The bed has safety stops on so you will never have to worry about the bed shooting out. Pull back your blanket and the tissue to find your paper. Pull back the paper slowly to reveal your print. The edition is 250 and there are 8 artist proofs left. For more information please visit our website shopshirefinearts.co.uk or call or email us on jenny at shopshirefinearts.co.uk